a new counter-drone focused variant of the 8x8 Striker light armored vehicle armed with a laser directed energy weapon, laser guided 70mm rockets, a 30mm automatic cannon, radars and other sensors has broken cover. Defense contractor Leonardo DRS and its industry partners are actively pitching the vehicle to the US Army, which is looking to significantly grow its short-range air defense capabilities in the coming years. That service is also very interested in new laser-armed options, specifically after lackluster field tests of a different striker-based system earlier this year. In this case, Leonardo acts more as an integrator of existing solutions than a developer of each individual component. The striker platform comes from General Dynamics, while all the mounted anti-drone weapons are the result of partnerships with seven key companies. For instance, the combat laser, Locust, with a power output of 26 kilowatt, comes from American firm Blue Halo. It's going to provide a directed energy capability that can kill Group 1s, 2s, 3 UAS at very long range. Ed House Senior Director of Business Development at Leonardo DRS says in the video, that uh, several industry partners put together over the last eight months. It's going to provide a directed energy capability that can kill Group 1s, 2s, 3 UASs at very long range. The vehicle's weapon station, the R400 from Australian company EOS, features an XAM 914-30mm automatic cannon and a secondary machine gun. Combined with the station's advanced fire control system, it becomes a highly effective tool against unmanned aerial vehicles. For its missile-based air defense solution, Leonardo chose the Advanced Precision Kill Weapon System, APKWS, developed by British company BAE Systems. A cost-effective and pragmatic choice, likely influenced by real combat experience in Ukraine. The Ukrainian Defense Forces have used APKWS in conjunction with the Vampire Launch System since February 2024, and it proved particularly effective against Shahed Kamikaze drones deployed by the Russian Invasion Army. In addition to these weapons, the CUAS Directed Energy Striker is equipped with an electronic warfare system, though the video doesn't showcase its capabilities. No less important than the means of destruction is the ability to detect and track UAV. For this, the CUAS Striker relies on a direction-finding system and a network of small NMHR radars with active, electronically scanned array ESA technology, developed by Leonardo. These radars are already in use on other military platforms, such as the IM Shorad. At this stage, the purpose of the CUS Directed Energy Striker demonstration is to draw attention to its potential. Leonardo is targeting primarily the US Army, which is actively seeking effective anti-drone solutions to protect ground forces while on the move, at deployment sites, and during all stages of battle. Together, we can help the, the Army solve problems, and in this case, we're moving directed energy forward for the Army. Uh, we have lots of folks that are helping us. And we've got best-of-breed technologies included in the, in the striker behind me.